Good morning, I'm Mary Ellen from the channel Mary Ellen After 60 and today I'm here to share with you the products I've used up, what I, what I will purchase, what I won't repurchase and there's just a couple that I gave up on. So I'm going to start with something I'm going to go a little bit in depth on and it is the Color Wow Dream Coat and no I've never done a sponsored video but I have used this now for over a year and it has been a real game changer for me. Above, I'm going to put a time that I quit talking about this, so if you're not interested, you can go to the next, what I'm talking about. I started using this last February, and I have just finished it. It's the Color Wild Dream Coat, and what this does, it smooths your hair, and I want to share with you how I use it. I probably should have checked my hair <laughs> before I'm going to talk about this. What my routine is, when I wash my hair the first time of the month, I just use this once a month now, but when my hair is just about, I'd say, 25% dry, I will go into the bathroom and I will, what I do, because I always derma roll my scalp after every shampoo. So I will go in the bathroom, I will use one of these clips, and the area that I derma rolled I'll put this clip in like this and get all that hair. And then what I do is I start with each section and I put it and I go down. So if this lasts a year, you know how much I use. And then I will just go section by section and go all the way down. And then I comb it through and then I go to the next section. So then I'll just take this, hold it up and do the ends and I don't get it on my scalp that way. So the things I've learned that are really important is do not overuse it. Mine is to smooth my hair. If you watch any of my older videos, I have a problem with frizz. So when I use this product, I do not use anything else other than what I do for my derma rolling. It was a few weeks ago when I did this. I don't have any hair products on at all today just because I didn't, but I washed my hair yesterday. After you have it on your hair, you wanna blow dry your hair and that's the only time I use the hotter setting on the blow dryer because you want to kind of seal that in. Since I started using the Color Extend shampoos, that's why I think I only need to use this once a month. Last year I was using it every third or fourth shampoo. And what I normally do, I wash my hair, don't wash it for two days and wash it the next day. And after my hair is dry, I just use a, I usually use one of the Callista tools. I just go through my hair and that's all I do. But I'm a really a pretty fuss-free hair person. The first bottle was sent to me from Color Wow. So after I used this a couple of times, I knew I loved it, so I purchased one. I'm getting ready to open that up and I will use that the very first time I shampoo my hair next month. I used up the Color Wow Color Security Shampoo. This was given to me by ColorWow. I will repurchase it. I'm waiting on a coupon, but I have found quite a few other ones that I like too. And I also used up the conditioner, but I guess I threw that one away. This is the Kenra Platinum Blow Dry Spray. One of these last about a year. And I, I use this anytime I blow my hair dry, except for when I use the Dream Coat, and then I don't use it. And I've already opened up another one, started it on March 6th, though I'm going to make sure this lasts a year, but I have it dated, piece of scotch tape over it. I like to kind of see for sure how long it lasts. I use a lot less than my hairstylist. She uses that all the time, but I just like the way my hair behaves after I've used it, so that's a winner. I love it when I use up a scent, and I used up two, and this is Falling in Love. This is a one when I used to work at the hospital. Anytime I wore it, some, some man would always say, what are you wearing? And the other is Amazing Grace. And I won't repurchase it, but it wouldn't surprise me at all to receive it as a gift from one of my family members. Those two scents and just the regular YSL opium are, are the scents that my children relate to me. This is the It's Secret Sauce that I probably use five nights a week. This one lasted nine months and I've already repurchased it. I didn't keep the bottle, but this is the Timeless uh, Vitamin C Plus E Plus Rulic Acid. I, I kept this box. I opened it on 5-12-2019 and it lasted till 10-21-2019 and I always keep my Timeless in the refrigerator. So I do have the box. 
This I finished, I think, sometime last winter. I opened it on 21818 and I bought the reset built size. It's a Matrixel 3000 serum and, and I've already repurchased another one. Every time the seasons change, I throw away my It Superhero because this is my favorite mascara and I open a new one and I put the little tie on the new one. And this I finished up. I, I kind of gave up on it to tell you the truth. But this is by It Cosmetics and it's a lash blowout. I was really disappointed. It, it was good, but I don't know why they put out another mascara when what they already have was so good. But that's just my opinion. Anyway, this is gone, but I do like the brush and I'm going to wash it and keep it to separate my lashes. I like to use a, a dry, clean mascara one to separate my lashes because I've hit my eye with those metal combs before and I don't like to use those. I gave up on two products. This is from Ulta. This is the Mattifying Balm. I love the Mally Pore Defender. And I wanted this to be as good, but it just wasn't. I did hit pan, it broke, and life's too short to be using things I don't like. It's kind of what I think anyway. Here's the Mally Pore Defender. I use, a, a, this is when I use a, a beauty sponge. And after I have on my foundation, I bounce it on my face in areas that looked a little bit too glowy, but I, I like this in one of these last a year. So I don't think I'm gonna be trying anything new to take its place. I've never tried it on bare skin, but I use it on top of my foundation. This is an older It by By Pores Primer. I just didn't like it and I've had it for quite some time. I've probably had this one a couple of years, so I'm just gonna throw it away. This is a, this used to house some Tony, it's, I think it's Tony Moly lip products. Well, what I did was I buy the used to buy the large tube of the Lancinol nipple cream for my lips, and I put some in here, and well, it's kind of gone bad. So what I do now is I just buy the three little tubes. I use this every night on my lips, and, and I've been really happy. Haven't had chapped lips in years. And I finished a tube of the Grand Lash or Grande Lash MD. I'm gonna throw this part away and I'm gonna wash this because this I've used this to use for eyeliners and I like to have two eyeliners of the same size if I use like gel eyeliner because I don't like double dip in them. So I'm gonna wash this and throw this away. And there's an It No Tug Navy Eyeliner for, that I use for my upper waterline that I finished. And because of Susan W, and I wish Susan W made videos again, I finished my smoothie peeling gel and the date it was, I started using it 12, 2017. I used it for my face for probably about a year and a half. And the last time I threw some away and she goes, she left in the comments, well, you should have used that on your body. And, and I did, and it worked really well. But I like, I haven't tried one of the fruit enzymatic pills from Amazon that I haven't just really liked. Very gentle. It does exfoliate your skin very well. And I don't need to repurchase right now because I have two that I use interchangeably. I think one of them is a lemon and one of them is just a fruit, but that's that. And another thing I use when I'm not using the Color Wow, I finished up the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In. I think it's excellent. I have a couple others that are a lot more expensive than this that I'm using now. After I've washed my hair, when I take it down from the towel, I will just squirt a little bit on the ends just so my comb glides through easily. And the last thing I used up were the It Bye Bye Wipes. I said I wasn't gonna repurchase them, but I got them for less than half price. And I haven't opened them yet, but I have them if I need them, and I'm, I'm glad I do. But that I filmed this video on March 13th. It was the last time that Jim left the house. He went over to the next town over to do a grocery pickup. So I just took the opportunity to film a video. And I don't have any other videos filmed. I'm not really sure what I want to film. So we'll just see. We'll take it week by week. I'm here to announce the winners of last week's giveaway. And it was for the Buxom Lip Gloss Trio, the Magnetic Lashes, the Wonder Beauty I have eye masks and the BK Beauty sponge and the first winner is Melanie Rose congratulations Melanie 
The second winner is Karen Presley. Congratulations, Karen. Make sure you leave a comment below so I can let you know to, how to get in touch with me. And I also want to thank you for the compliments that I got on my curly hair. And in the information below, I will put a link to how I got those curls if you're interested in seeing it. If you have any product recommendations, be sure and list them below because I, I enjoy reading what other people are, are liking. It is all good. Thank you so much for watching. You guys have a great day and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Take care. I use it the, but why my, this is the one I say is a men magnet, but I, I, I when I, after I wash my hair, when I take it down from, from it, this is an old Tony, Tony, first Sunday of the month, no, Revlon,